Many good memories on this camera, but we got a new one, so we gotta make new memories. So, this is called the Ordro HDV 7 V8. I said 7. Well, it's got a picture of a man and the camera. So, yeah, this is, I believe, from Japan. This is a digital video camera slash digital camera, and it is 24 megapixels. So this is actually made in China, not Japan, so, you know, so let's start unboxing it. So this is kind of like a, a re-unboxing because my dad unboxed it and charged it so I can just show you guys, so thank you. So first thing we have here in the package, small package is the remote so t means zoom in w means zoom out i don't know why but that's how it is there's a pause record lighting so um there's a light on it picture delete backwards volume up volume down forwards and front so a lot of buttons and it runs on a little battery it's not chargeable and you have to like point it at it. It won't work without that. So. But next we have the digital video camera holder. To be honest, it looks like a little fanny pack. <laughs> so here it is. And it has a extra strap in it. So um, to be honest, I think it's just to strap the camera on to you. So we're going to blow this out of the way just so you guys can see it better. So it has an extra pocket in the front. It has a attachable strap, attachable strap, and another attachable strap on the sides and back. And it's a uh, pretty small because it's a kind of big, kind of small camera. So nothing that much. And it says DVC. Get on to the next thing. So the next thing we have is the USB connector. So this is how I would upload to my dad's computer, basically. Open it, you guys. I'm going to show you guys. So, so it has caps on it right now, just to keep it secure. But this is how it is. Pretty big. Yeah, so let's see what we have. Next, we have all the manuals. I believe they're all in China word. Uh, yes. These are all in words I don't understand. <laughs> so this is the user's manual. manual. Um, okay, so like half of it is in... English and then the rest of the half is in other languages I don't know. So, so I believe this is this is to connect it to TV. So, <laughs> so it's secured. Make sure it's not secured. We have a white, yellow, and black cord, which I believe yes, these are for um, TVs. So we we'll be able to hook up our camera to our TV. So that'd be cool. And so let's see what this looks like. Uh, this, I believe, let's see what this is. I might need to look it up, but I think it's a charger. But then what would this be? Yeah, pretty sure this is an extra charger. So yeah, it's secured like all the other ones. So lastly, so everything everyone's been waiting for, Wait, nope. <laughs> Next, yes. So, I, these go together. Seems to be a charger.
charger. It looks like my battery charger. So we may be dealing with batteries. Yeah. So this is the charger. So yeah. <laughs> and lastly, for everything everyone's been waiting for, we have the camera. Da -da -da -da. So we're gonna put this box aside for now. Get it out of the way. Let's on the package. turns on when you open it. So let's see if I can show you guys. Have it the other way. Yeah. There we go. Currently, if you guys can see, I'm recording. Not really, but so it has a flippable screen screen so I can see myself whenever. So that's cool. And then let's see, I'll show you everything else. So first, before we use the button, we're going to go through the modes on what to use on this. If you, at any chance, lose your remote, if you have this camera. I don't know. Okay, so now we have you where you can see better. So, you have these buttons. Here, let's flip this thing over so you can see. So we have these buttons. So there's the camera button that takes photos we have the zoom in you can see that I'm zooming in and zooming out that's that button and this is not a button so and I'm gonna show you guys this part this is not a button either at first I thought it was but I guess not <laughs> so we're gonna show you how it looks a little And let's see how the camera is. It's pretty nice. So over here, we're going to close this. And it turns off, and it shows busy, which means off, and then charging on the other side. And then there's this thing for TV, um, HDMI, and the charging. And then right here is the recording button, and it comes with a little thing for you and here's the lens and the light up top it is a f 2.6 which equals 7.0 m i mean <laughs> 0 mm so it's pretty cool now i can't show you most of these because i don't have a card in there yet but eventually, when I get to it, I will show you guys. So we're going to turn this off and we're going to put it away. So, honestly, even without the light, the resolution of how it looks is really nice. And it's going to be great once I start doing my videos. And the last thing I'd like to say, this is going to be a two-part video. Because if you see here, there's two little holes. And what is that for, you may ask? Well, I have the answer. For my next video, I'm going to be doing a tripod unboxing. I already have one, but it's really crummy, and I got it from the Goodwill. So I thought that I should get a new one, and it's better, and you can move it up and down. And so we're going to do an unboxing, and then you just catch it right there. I will start using this once I get used to it, and I'll start recording. I will be keeping this camera on tripod for a backup say if anything ever happens or maybe I want to take it to the Hurricane Harbor because I'm definitely not going to save this Hurricane Harbor. I may make an exception for actual Six Flags but not Hurricane Harbor. Now of course I'm not going to bring a tripod to Hurricane Harbor or Six Flags. That's just weird. But if I can't bring the camera I'm using right now, I can just use my phone or tablet. But if not, I can just use that camera. And 
And when I'm done with the tripod, I will also start using better tripod because it always folds over and that's annoying too. So stay wild, my wild cubs, and I love you guys.